Darwin Nunes has signed for Liverpool. Who is Darwin Nunes? Darwin Nunes is a right-footed six-foot-two striker who is also capable of playing on the wing. So there is capabilities that most strikers wouldn't be able to handle. That is why Liverpool have signed him. He was born in Artigas in Uruguay. As a young boy, he spent his youth at the Leleuz Academy. He was then noticed by Penarol at just 14. So he signed for Penarol and spent a few years there. And then at 18, this is when he really started his journey into international and European football. He joined Almira in the second division of Spain where he spent two years before Benfica spotted his unique talent. Benfica have had a brilliant um, academy and always look at their scouts to find them the best players at the right age and if you're playing for Benfica or Porto or Sporting Lisbon you have got real talent they always get the best and they always make money so if, you, if they think he's good this boy must be talented while at Benfica he was relatively unnoticed around Europe until his brilliant performances last season scoring 34 in 41 appearances and more impressively six goals in 10 Champions League appearances considering they didn't get too far in the Champions League and the teams they had to play six goals in 10 for your first real uh, first team Benfica Champions League run is is very good um, at international level he has yet to get started only two in 11 games but I'm sure he will grow into international football when he is playing with world-class players at Liverpool where would Klopp like to play him and as I said similar to Sadio Mane he with his athletic frame acceleration and striking the ball explosively he those, those boxes are ticking with Sadio Mane. Maybe not the athletic frame, but Mane is very athletic. This boy could be even quicker. This boy could be stronger. But has he got the mindset that Sadio Mane had before he left to go to Bayern Munich? Klopp would probably like to play him on the left and Jota up front. But there's a problem. He's just signed, uh, obviously, Luis Diaz. Jota, I think, has been unfairly treated at Liverpool. You have to deal with this when you're playing in every single competition last season, all the finals, very close to the league. But Jota's goal-scoring form is, is absolutely brilliant, considering he doesn't start many games. But I think the team will be Salah on the right, Diaz on the left, and Darwin Nunes up front, with competition, obviously, from Roberto Firmino and Diego Jota. But there's also a different Salah recently. He looks very focused on the centre part of the pitch. So the right hand side doesn't get much width. This is real, real critique of Liverpool. They're a brilliant team. But if you think Salah's going to want to go for the golden boot again, maybe it's time for Salah to go central. And maybe Diaz could go on the right hand side and Nunes on the left. Salah is He's very greedy. He wants the goals. He wants the assists. Anyway, very exciting times for Liverpool. Thank you very much for watching. See you later.